What's up guys? It's the final round. My name is Jordan. This is a channel where the episodes come out the day before the lines drop. Um, I give you guys uh, information that I see uh, based off historical data um, for good opportunities or bad opportunities for players. And when the lines do drop, I have a Discord. The link is in the description. You can join there and there's discussion that goes on all day long uh, about the lines and there's uh, smart people in there. Um, that you can join and chat with and I don't charge for picks I, I don't have a premium or anything um, I, I I don't think you should pay for something if you don't know if it's gonna work yet or not uh, so if you do well and you feel like giving back I have a cash app and a Venmo in the description you can donate and that helps uh, pretty much pay for the the time uh, that I'm putting into all of this so if you can please like the video uh, subscribe to the channel if you have not and if you have a little bit of time, leave a comment for the algorithm. Uh, I got a lot of, uh, of cat dog. Uh, shout out to cat dog from uh, Nickelodeon uh, back in the, in the day. But you can leave a comment. Just anything helps. It could be one letter. Uh, it could be a hello, a bye. Um, uh, it could be an animal. Uh, just anything helps. Uh, get the video out there. And I very much appreciate that as well. And uh, I'm also partnered with uh, two different apps, uh, Jock Market and Thrive fantasy i saw jock market had uh dame's uh points line at 29 and a half for today so i i guess they they didn't get the memo uh, but you can find good lines on uh both of them it's i think it's good to have multiple apps to see different lines um use promo code find around 11 and they both uh, will match up to a hundred dollars uh so uh, if you want some free uh hundred dollars <laughs> Uh, sign up uh, with final round 11 and um, uh, I'd appreciate that. So guys, I did not have much time like at all today. A uh, ton of work volume uh, was very heavy and then I had to help a 10 year old with his homework. Um, so I do not have the who's hot section and I have six picks that I found for you guys. I almost wasn't going to make a video at all. Um, so, but I, I found six of them for you guys and uh, I'm gonna give you the six and I'll try to get to the who's hot section and more picks. Um, I usually do eight to ten um, and sometimes I go crazy and do like 18. Uh, but so six picks is kind of low uh, but I'm just trying to get something out there for you guys to think about. There's definitely going to be a lot more plays. Um, if you think about it, every single player has a right answer and a wrong answer. So. Uh, there's plays everywhere, uh, and it's a pretty big slate. Uh, so the first look's going to be Marcus Smart up against the Cleveland Cavaliers. Uh, Marcus Smart had a good game last game uh, with Jalen Brown out. Uh, I think he was out for personal reasons. Uh, so hopefully Jalen Brown is back and Marcus Smart isn't going to get as many shots. The Cavaliers give up the least points, the least rebounds, and the fourth least assists to the point guard position. And Marcus Smart over his last 10 games has 11 and a half points, uh, five and a half assists, and four rebounds. So keep an eye on Jalen Brown. Even if he's out, Marcus Smart's lines should go up. He's got a terrible matchup. But second picks, I gotta go back to Bam at a bio. He's, they're playing a back-to-back -back rematch uh, with the Sixers who, who give up the second least points and the third least rebounds. And Kevin Love is probable again to play. Kevin Love is snatching rebounds away from Bam Adebayo. So over his last 10 games, he has 20 and a half points and nine rebounds. In that last game they played, he had 13 points and seven rebounds. Third pick's gonna be Nick Claxton up against the Knicks uh, with Mitchell Robinson back, who has been gr grabbing a ton of rebounds if you wanna take a look at his prop. The Knicks give up the fifth least points and the least rebounds to the center position. And Claxton, ever since that trade, has kind of fallen off uh, fallen away over his last 10 games he has 10 points and 10 rebounds uh, so i'm looking at the under for nick claxton on points and rebounds fourth pick uh john morant i know i took him today it's today for me but it's gonna be yesterday for you uh, i saw john morant started to heat up in the second half and he's taking off this is the rockets uh the rockets are giving up a ton of points to jamal murray from what i see they give up 71 to dame it's John Morant's turn. They give up the most points, the six most assists, and the most three-pointers to the point guard position. And Morant's averaging 26 points and 8.7 assists in his last 10 games. So definitely looking at points and assists. Uh, he's playing great right now. 
Um, after a terrible first half, he's feeling himself in this. This uh, Rockets defense isn't going to stop any point guard. Fifth pick, Mikel Bridges up against the Knicks. The Knicks give up the second most points and the fifth most three pointers to the small four position. And Bridges has been hot lately. Uh, he's having a great game uh, as we speak. He's averaging 22 and a half points and two and a half three pointers since joining the Nets. Uh, so um, I like his over in this matchup. And sixth pick is going to be DeAndre Ayton up against the Hornets. They give up the third most points, the 10th most rebounds, and the ninth most blocks to the center position. And Ayton over his last 10 games has 23 points, 10 rebounds, and 1.2 blocks. Uh, so points, rebounds, and blocks for DeAndre Ayton. So that's my six picks. Um, sorry, I, it's not as much as you guys are used to, um, but I... It wasn't going to be a video at all. So um, I appreciate all you guys. Uh, thank you for all the new subscribers. Something happened with that last video and the subscribers shot up like crazy. And um, uh, I'd like to help out as many people as I can and, and not charge you guys anything. Uh, someone mentioned uh, maybe I can be successful enough on here to quit my day job, but I really like my day job. I, I work in analytics at a big bank. Uh, so these numbers and trying to find all this stuff is fun to me. Um, and hopefully I, I can do well transitioning over to a different sport once NBA is over. So thank you all for watching. God bless you all. Have a great day. Uh, it's final round. My name is Jordan. Bye.